MTV program from Wakefield High. Hi, I'm Kevin Timmons, your host, and we'll be talking about cars. Uh, Flynn, what's your favorite car? Uh, I like uh, Mercedes, BMWs, all the rich cars. All the rich cars. Ed? Yeah? What's your favorite type of car? So is your favorite make or model? Or yeah, just model. Not, well, I mean, I, I, I like, you know, m mostly foreign cars. Uh, well, uh, Volkswagen. Uh, Volkswagen can be nice. I want to borrow my, my boss's Jetta. And, you know, winded up in a parking lot and just, it, it was fun, fun times. But I really, you know, I, I'm really not sure. I mean, a, a lot of different types of cars, really. You know. All right. Dan? What was the question? What's your favorite type of car? Model? Uh, for a Chevy Blazer, but I also like Ed's Ball. Ed's yeah, Ball. Ball is nice. Nice car. May, may, it, may it rest in pieces. <laughs> in pieces. Wait, in pieces. Can I get rid of that car? Matt? Um, well, I like the Chevys, any kind of Chevys, preferably Camaros. He's like, he's like Chevy Thunderbirds. Uh, so, what else do you like? Uh, pizza. Trucks are nice. Trucks. Ed, do you have any stories about trucks? Cars. Yeah, I made a mistake. Yeah. I, got, I, got, I made a mistake. You know, because you kind of got around the corner so fast. It, it was a Ford Explorer. And you hit yeah. it with the Volvo. Hit with the Volvo. Who won? You uh, hit a Ford Explorer. Yeah. Who won? Who won? My car's totaled. He has a scratch on his left side. <laughs> <laughs> Who won? I, I gotta be. I, I'm kind of amazed though. You know, always buckle up because the seatbelt kind of saved my life. It's kind of kind of cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, so you're gonna get a new car? Well, yeah, we're gonna see what you know insurance company says. But what are you looking for? I don't know. I mean, I'd like to get an older, you know, BMW or an older Fiat. Definitely a Fiat. You know, that'd be kind of a nice car. Aren't they small? Well, yeah, yeah. different. Not 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 like a you know a smaller, like a, like a larger Fiat. You know, oh. a, little, a little red Italian sports car sort of. Right. Okay. Dad? Didn't your dad have a nice car, Dan? Uh, yeah. What kind of car does your dad have? Uh, it's a 1955 Chevy. 1955 Chevy. <laughs> what model? I don't know. Uh -huh. Good nice condition. Car. Good condition. Cool. Does it go fast? <laughs> <laughs> yes, very fast. My, uh, my parents have a 54 Chevy. Oh, really? Yeah. Pretty cool. Nice. You know, um... Uh, well, that's about all the time we have today. It looks like a bell. Uh, see you later. I think it is. Yeah. See you next time. Thank you for watching Wakefield Mornings with your host, Kevin. Join us again for another exciting show where anything can happen and usually does. Thanks, everybody. Go ahead.
Good evening. You're watching Wakefield Moments, a three-minute interview program from Wakefield High TV Studio. Hi. 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 I'm your host, Sean. Today we're talking about video games. Hey, do you play video games? Honestly, no. You look like you play video games. You smell like you play video games. <laughs> yeah. You ever play I any video games? I haven't played a video game in, dude, three, your game three is years. Drugs, dude. <laughs> That's why I don't play video games, because your game is drugs. Yeah. <laughs> So what was your favorite video game back uh, three years ago? I don't know. I, I just remember sitting in my room with, 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 with my Sega. You know, with, with, with my, my old controller with the Sega. You know, different games, yeah, a couple of racing Super games. Super Mushroom Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> so Josh, do you play video games? Yeah. Do you? What's your favorite video game? I don't know, I really haven't been playing, so... No? No. That's too bad. Video games are awesome. <laughs> Russo, you look like you can play a lot of video games. Yeah. You look like you got a lot of time on your hands. Yeah, I do all the time. Yeah. yeah. And what's your favorite video game? I like Grand Theft Auto 3. Do you? Yeah. What's your favorite car in that game? Um, I kind of like the Banshee. The Banshee? Yeah. Now what? What? I'm sorry. I'm just kind of curious. What exactly is this banshee? It's like another model of the uh, viper. Oh, okay. So it's like a viper car. Okay, cool. So I picking guess. your nose, Pat. Um, <laughs> you play any video games with them dirty fingers of yours? <laughs> no, I just eat at buffets open to the public. Oh, <laughs> We're dude. McDonald's. <laughs> we food for everyone in this town. <laughs> 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 Stop by after school and get something to eat there. Mention this ad and get it half off. <laughs> <laughs> then you get the pick your order. <laughs> yeah. So you ever play any video games, Pat? Yeah. Or you just pick your nose a lot. It's virtual and it happens all the time. So. <laughs> what is your favorite video game? Um, Pac-Man. Packing boogies into his nose. <laughs> Packing my finger. <laughs> Show Ed. So Sega Ed. Oh, back in the day. Yeah, that was good back in the day. But that's all the time we have, so I'll see you guys all next week. When we're talking about God knows what. You have been watching Wakefield Moments with your host, Sean, the Quick Fingers McNelty. Join us again for another exciting show where anything can happen. Pat usually picks his nose. Wakefield Moments, I'm your host, Ryan Graves. Our topic is driving cars. Okay. Ed, do you like driving cars? It, it is my favorite pastime. You know, just getting in a car and just not even having a destination, just getting out in the road and just going. I mean, you, you, you never know where you're going to end up. It, it's a lot yeah, of fun, you know? You're going to end up underneath an explorer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the hey, do you like driving cars? Have you ever driven a car? Uh, I have driven a car once. But when I get my license, I'm definitely not going to drive like Ed. <laughs> you drive like me? I'm a mad man. Sean, you're a pretty good driver. Do you like driving cars? Like um. It's dangerous. Can't speed. It's bad for you. 
And you had a ton of worth of metal behind you. Mm. Especially when you hit a tree, like I did. <laughs> yeah. What happened to the car? Or truck? Car. Um, my hood bent up. Totaled? No. Oh, good. I was only doing 30, but it's still it back? wet. back? Have the car back? Yeah, I did. And it got ganked from me. They're driving like an idiot. Do you like driving cars? I like driving cars. Mm -hmm. like Ever driven a car? Yeah, I'm a parent. Mm -hmm. well, <laughs> what's your favorite kind of car to drive? To drive? Oh, I had a friend who had a f old that had a vet. Vet? Vet. That's a nice. That yeah, was fun to drive. When I was eight years old at a Power Wheels. It said ages eight to ten, but I was I got too fat when I was ten. It wouldn't pull me. Was, it was chugging. I like driving big trucks. Yeah, big trucks. Nice. Big trucks are the most fun to drive. How big? Like, as big as you can get them. Like 18 Dan, if you ever drove? I haven't driven an 18 wheel. Uh, definitely not. That thing's pretty nice. Yeah. Now, what's that, a four on the floor? Or? Big Mac. Your dad's car. Stick. I like to drive my dad's Jeep. Because it's easy, though. My sister has a Celica, and it's like this high up the ground. <laughs> can I drive it? Sled. I'm going on the hill. The Jeep is stick? No, that's what I get. I can have my mom's car. She has a, a stick, and I messed up the first time. Well, that's all we have today for a week of moments. Join us again next time. You're watching Wakefield Moments with your host, Ryan. Join us again next week for another exciting show where anything ca can happen and usually doesn't. Hello. We had some blah 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 and so Sapa. What do you think of the show? I think the show is bad. Because there's no audience right now. Hey, and we're frozen on TV. Never mind. <laughs> well not only is the TV over there messed up, we didn't count to ten to check. There's no audience. There's about eight or nine people in here. Like I don't even know if there's enough people in the Amiga. I just think the show is pretty bad. Do you like my handheld mic? No. I don't, because you're supposed to have a normal mic as a host. But you couldn't get it in. You couldn't get it in. You couldn't get it in. Do you, get it in. Do you see this thing? It's we didn't tell them to record, but they did anyway. Do Why? It's bad. Yeah, we really recording. It's bad. Is this recording? Oh, that's cool. Can we talk about Bob? Yeah, let's talk about Bob. Bob's a funny kid. He gets mad a lot. What? What? And he got two concussions in two days, and I'll never <laughs> stop reminding him about that. Why? And then Frank. <laughs> oh, Frank, say something to the camera. This show sucks. Um, this is taping, so. <laughs> I don't think he cares. So, what do you think about Bob being like a prep today? What is up with that? I think that's the I weirdest thing I've ever seen. Bob's being preppy. That's what? What that's is a new that? One. That's a Bob, very, I don't know. Bob going for a new look or something? I don't think he tried to be. That's why he's getting pissed. Bob is always confused. It just comes natural to Bob. Alex, you're coming. You're on WK. What do you think about Delcor? And that is wicked blind in my eye. <laughs> and we have don't a, shine that toy review. We have a nice close up of our tree. <laughs> and then uh they Even named the tree don't Lisa. Lisa. Yeah, they did. The tree? They just put something in front of a tree and named it Lisa. <laughs> I can do anything <laughs> on TV. <laughs> I don't know. No. I hope not. Well, for some reason, we only got 30 seconds left. We are out of time, but this why? Show sucks. We, we wanted the show to go no forever and ever. Have we really been sitting here for nope. three minutes? I don't think we've been sitting here for three minutes. All right, you guys are horrible. Hold okay, people. Goodbye.
Take one. <laughs> Are we recording? So, ah, about what was that for? I single handedly can ruin Steve a single Delcor evening. Ruined Alex's life. Alex! You didn't ruin my life. How did I ruin your life? You're a jerk. Explain. No, you just fine. Yeah. I was going to drop my drawers in the car. That's mean. I'm just the random yeah, guest here that has boy. nothing to do with the show. I know, but still. That's so I'm just going to sit here. Hey, you, focus on me. Camera one, two, focus on me. The Frank. <laughs> I can't read that. <laughs> Jimmy the female try. <laughs> 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 oh, that was great. Well, we have idiots in the control. Can I come back? No, you can't, and you have to put your microphone back on. Jimmy the trucker. Jimmy, <laughs> Jimmy the female. Frankie. Yes. What you do in your life? Yeah, I don't know. What did you do over the weekend? Okay. I can't say that or I'll get in trouble. But I'll say anyways, I got stoned. I got drunk last night. Richie Bruno. Come here. Yeah. Had people stab my coach. That kind of sucked. And then orange soda was spilt all over my rug. What are you hitting me for? Is this show open? <laughs> no, they just decided to screw <laughs> around. Get over here. Steve Austin, I'm going to close that post yourself. What do you want me to get? Steve, I can read. Richie Bruno. <laughs> How did I ruin Alex's life? You didn't pick her up for a dance and then you went to the dance anyway. <laughs> I didn't pick her up because she told me she didn't want to go. No. Isn't that right, Alex? Yeah. Straight from the horse's mouth. Ow. Uh, <laughs> how much time do we have? Let's go back. I'm going to talk to Richie. Need? Ah, why are you hitting me? Fair enough. Why do we keep doing this? <laughs> the girl doesn't like to. I'm gonna interview the camera. I'm just gonna start yelling. Camera number two. That stuff. How are you? Well, I'm pretty good. Oh wow. <laughs> no. She's so, so pissed. pissed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is pathetic. Um, can we please cut this show? It's the ruining of a girl's life. No. I'm not talking. Might as well not. You're not talking. Our guest of the show. Hey, Richie. Hey, Steve. You got it. Joe. Come on. Richie? Yeah, she is. She's in there. Am I? How's it going? 
I'm your host for the show. Okay. Frank Daddy. Rocking, rocking the mic. Got Thank that you. right. Thank you. I'm here to talk about absolutely nothing. How come? Have a topic. Well, I'm great at talking about nothing. But I think if we just talk about this little doohickey hanging from his neck right On here. On my leg? Your what? Lay. Lay? L E I L I E. What? L I E. Lay. A lay. What's a lay? This. It's a bunch of different colors. What is it though. for? I don't know. You get it when you're walking in the Kowloon. I found it in the control room. In Kowloon? What's so it doing in the Was there a party in there, you're saying? There could be. I think there's a party going on in our control room tonight. I think we're going to have to go. Okay. I think we are. Yeah. I think we're going to go. Most likely. Okay. Shawnee Poo, the human fish. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I have one question for the people in the control room. What are they doing? What are you in thinking? It? Stop petting me. Excuse me. I, excuse Please me. Like, if I, just is my bugs. <laughs> Don't pass my bugs. <laughs> 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 Uh. Ah, ah. Uh. <laughs> uh, do you have any information? <laughs> the criminal you have seen. <laughs> criminal right here. Hey, I'm not a criminal, even though I was arrested. Doesn't arrested count. for what? Please arson, call. murder, grand larceny, grand theft auto. Grand theft auto, yeah. Uh, attempted assassination. Attempted assassination. Treason? You have treason? I have treason. Yeah. I get that. I've I have attempt to throw over the government, but only, they only found me with a vial of acid. Oh my god. And they only, they charged me with attempt to throw over the government? Yeah. That is because it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's mind, a mind altering mind substance. Mind altering substance. And you can get, that yeah. can like, you know, control your ideas. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm not really liking this. Now the cops are all going to come and find us. We're going to have Joe, to leave the show right now, I, I think. I am not so. a criminal. So, guys, it's, it's been nice seeing you, but calm down. If the cops come, you're all my hostages. <laughs> I know, so it's bad that you guys are doing this. I may not have a gun or anything, but you're all my hostages. We're we up. have our fists. That's all yeah, you need. that's all we, we need. need. Yeah, we got sneakers. Just put their face sneakers down. Too, yeah. Turn the chair over and just put their face in. We got a mic, too. We could do some more of the damage. Is that the show, or what's going on here? Yeah. I guess we're just going to wrap it up now, so. You're a good host, Frank. I know, I know. Nice seeing you again. I tried my best. I just did that, all right? You said you wrapped it up already. Say all right, well, goodbye. I'll do it again. All right, bye. Okay. Oh, that's just a chance. I'm probably going to be chilling. Guys. Frankie, we what? were on. Um, oh, we're on? Oh, we're on. I was supposed to fight between these two that I tried scheduling last year. If our cameraman would be quiet. Hey! Quiet. Okay, Now, last year.
last year. If we could go to camera two, please. Okay. I tried setting up a fight between these two. Between these two. Please go to camera two. Could you please go to camera two? Please go to camera. Okay, this okay, this is Joe Conway. Now, he's a really big kid. Big Butterball Conway is his name. <laughs> That's his fighting name. Butterball. Butterbean. Butterbean Conway. Fighting. Hey, we're filming. Frankie Cresta. Don't walk. Don't walk. Hey, I'm going to punch you in the face now. <laughs> At least camera one was. I just said don't walk through. What'd you do? No, you walk Frankie, through. Frankie, your anger is going towards Big Butterball Conway. Oh, well, no, now Frankie it's going Frankie towards him because he's just a <laughs> dirty little prick. See, now, now, this is Frankie don't know what so what, what should have an apostrophe after the T, but they're idiots in there. So. Yeah. And they spelled going wrong <laughs> because they're more. Oh, but these yeah. two, they were supposed to fight last year because who wouldn't want to see uh, a fight between like these two? Disney box. I'm telling you. I know. Think of the kind of money we would earn. You come up with the fifty dollars for me and Joe. Yeah, yeah, we'll be fine. We'll fight. We'll fight to the death for a hundred. No, you guys can fight in the class. It was supposed to be last year during A block algebra class. You guys remember that? Yes, 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 I do. That was a sweet class. Remember when you busted the window? No, I was I was absent that day. You missed a good day. I was so mad that I missed Mr. almost cried. He laughed in his <laughs> no, no, the best was when uh, when we had the hacky sack beats and we were throwing them in Christy's hair. Because <laughs> 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 she'd get up and, what are you doing to me? No, oh, they're throwing something. We don't want to throw it in the guys. Fredkin? I have a first name. <laughs> Do you want to go golfing tonight? Sure, That's all we have for today. I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Good evening. You are watching Whitfield Moments, a three-minute interview program from Whitfield Heights TV Studio. Okay. Uh, I am Steve. Uh, we're here with four people, and we're going to talk about tsunamis. Uh, Dan, what's your opinion on a tsunami? Uh, they're very dangerous. I was in one. My bathtub once um, got sucked up. I, I don't want to know died. about that. Uh, Frankie, tsunamis opinion. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's good enough. Wet, wet, rainy. I think there's wind. It could be. And I've never been in. This kid's been in one, but uh, bathtub. I'm yeah, I, I don't. That one. Uh, <laughs> What was, did, were you like splashing it? Were you like, ooh, okay. I, I, I just saw this big wave coming. A big wave. <laughs> big wave coming. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. That's crazy. My bath don't be like that big. I, can't, I, I can't fit in my bath. So and what were you big. doing taking a bath? <laughs> I know. <laughs> I've been taking a bath yeah. since I was like no, no, six. No. I passed over the maid for the husky mail. Okay, Pat, what's your opinion? <laughs> oh, okay, let's get back. <laughs> let's, get, let's get off of this bathtub. Pat. Tsunami opinion. Uh, I wouldn't mind, like, if I was ever gonna die, wouldn't mind dying in a giant tsunami. Like surfing? Yeah, it? surfing in one. Surfing it. And, uh, There's these guys in California that did. Well, they're idiots. 
Yeah, and they like ended up downtown. They was coming and they couldn't get out of the water. <laughs> so like, it surfed them all the way to like the middle of the city and like, they just got all cut up and two of them lives and two of them died. Uh, 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 Peter. <laughs> Peter. <laughs> Peter. Tsunami. Shoot. Uh, I've never seen a tsunami, ever. Mm -hmm. Why not? I don't even know what they are, <laughs> really. Why not? Uh -huh. I don't know. You haven't done your reading? I haven't had the choice. It's a really, really big wave. Yeah. <coughs> and there's like wind and rain. Uh, this kid. Uh, you know who loves Dan loves was friends. talking about Those him. swans. In his bath. Hey, Frankie. Okay, uh. Yeah, this, this is dead now. Uh, tsunamis, waves. Okay, well, we're wrapping it up now. Uh. <laughs> You have been watching Wakefield Moments with host Steve Delcor. Join us again for another exciting show where anything happens and usually does. Hello, this is Geraldine Ridden, and I hate all these kids like I hate my jerk punk son. Man, I'm gonna introduce this show to you, and then I'm gonna smoke four packs and kick my son out of the house. This is Wakefield Moments. <laughs> Alright, um, I guess my name's Frank and I'm gonna do some stuff for you. We're gonna talk about monkeys. Bob. What do you think about monkeys? <laughs> because Bob knows a lot about monkeys. Yeah, I know a lot about monkeys. Bob, what do you know about monkeys? See, you can train monkeys to do lots of things like steal people's wallets or smoke cigars and roll blade. That's good. That's real good. By training him to steal waltz, you won't have to work. You can just steal other people's money. It's going to be my plan. The crap well, too much. If I see a monkey on the street, I'm going to run. <laughs> Russo. Yes. What do you think about monkeys? Well, there's a lot of types of monkeys. You have killer monkeys, helper monkeys. The type of killer monkeys are the ones of Wizard of Oz that the witch sends out. I thought those were flying monkeys. They're, they're flying killer monkeys. They didn't kill yeah. anybody, though. Yeah, monkeys but they're attacking, so really? they're vicious. So they're flying, attacking vicious. monkeys? Yeah. So they're not killing. Oh, well, they're, they're attacking. They were going yeah. to kill. They had the chance yeah. to take a knife. God, God. They didn't fly around with a knife and stab people. <laughs> that would have been a better movie. Yeah, yeah it would have. The Wizard of Oz would have been much better if they had the monkeys fly around just stabbing people. Smoking cigars. Yeah. <laughs> Smoking cigars. Oh, yeah. When they roll blade, they flap their wings and go faster. I don't think they had roll blades in the 1920s. 
You never know. Yeah, they did. They were the roller skates. Roller skates, yeah. yeah. Skates. With four wheels on the your side. Yeah. You roll around and do stuff. What do you think about monkeys? Me? Yes, you. I'd like to own one. I know a guy has a pet monkey. Do you now? Lives in a huge stuff. cage. How you big is why? the monkey? Shakes people's hands. Oh, that's, that's a cool, cool monkey. What's his name? I would want a gorilla. Because those things are huge. I just sick them on Al over there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I guess I'm going to have to wrap it up now. So, bye. Oh, those kids are a bunch of jerks. Can't wait to throw all my son's clothes out the window when I get home. Wow, that kid's a loser. Don't join us next week, because none of you kids are going anywhere. Hello and welcome to Wakefield Moments. Today we're talking about large pets. I uh, guess one. Do you have any large pets? Nope. I just have a small dog. <laughs> I like large pets though. Uh, I guess two. Do you have any large pets? Uh, yeah. <laughs> what is it? His name is Shiba. Me black dog. Right. <laughs> uh, I guess the <laughs> What? <laughs> Do you have any large pets? Oh yeah. What is it? What about it? Shiba's mom. Shiba's mom. Oh. <laughs> No, I had a sheep dog. I did too. It, it was stupid dog. and got hit by a cat and it left. My lips were 18, then we put it to sleep. Man, guess what? Then I had a cocker spaniel and a princess. Got I had one <laughs> pet, large pet, what and it, it died. It was a dog. Yeah. What? Yes. What? What? You're a small pet. Guess one. Any large pets you'd like to own? Uh, no. Us too. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> I'll take it with me to school. And I'd walk around like Lawrence with some kids make fun of me. I'd be like, ah! And eat that pit bulls in them. Alright, uh, guess three. I'm gonna pet be monkey or a gorilla. Hmm. Just kill those kids. <laughs> I put him on a leash and have him attack people. Just grab my leg, go smash, smash. <laughs> <laughs> I guess Eat their brain. I probably have a snake, a large snake. Oh, um, oh yeah, snakes are cool. Yeah, you like snakes. <laughs> Big black snake. Little <laughs> <a> black snake. Help <laughs> 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 him. I'm trying to wrestle it. We can have all our animals fight. My crocodile can fight the uh, monkey. That's all the time we have for it. My gorilla feet. Right tonight. That's all the time we have for tonight. Uh, thank you for watching. <laughs> Funny if you see me going to sleep riding a crocodile. <laughs> I'm going to chop on your nuts. <laughs> oh, should we still have it? Try to see you next time. Try to see you. You've been watching Wakefield Moments with your host, Pat. Again, for another exciting show where anything can happen and usually does.